शिलोंग में कॉन्ट्रेक्चुअल शिक्षकों की रैली के दौरान पुलिस द्वारा की गई लाठीचार्ज और छोड़े गए आंसू गैस के गोले पर मुख्यमंत्री कॉनराड संगमा ने प्रतिक्रिया दी उन्होंने कहा कि वे रिपोर्ट का इंतजार कर रहे थे घटना में दो तीन बातें सामने आई है शिलोंग से सचिवालय वाले इलाके में धारा एक लागू थी शिक्षकों को वहां जाने की अनुमति नहीं थी उन्होंने कहा कि वे हिंसा के बजाय समस्या का बातचीत के जरिए समाधान में विश्वास रखते हैं This is, uh, in fact, uh, last time, as I was mentioning, we are, uh, uh, you know, waiting for some kind of a report. But one has to see uh, two, three things. Um, of course, uh, I am a person who is not in favour of violence in any situations. I think uh, in the last four and a half years, you must have seen that. And therefore, uh, I always, uh, uh, you know, any issue that is being there, I believe that always dialogue is the best way to move forward, and that's the reason I myself also always meet everybody. Uh, in that situation, there were a lot of conflicting and complicated situations. Uh, you know the permissions for them to come forward to the uh, secretariat was not given. There was section one four for those imposed, where the teachers had come, and uh, you know, and of course there were uh, you know uh, women out there, and uh, there were not enough police uh, women police out there. So these kind of complications came up. I guess if uh, you know proper communication in terms of permissions were given, say suppose, and they had come, then I think the system and would have been much more smoother. I'm guessing maybe the uh, the the, the Police and all saw the teachers and all were concerned if something may happen and hence uh, tear gas would be the most simplest way in one way to to disperse a crowd without going to you know violence of any any sort. उन्होंने कहा कि इस मामले पर फिलहाल बोलना उनके लिए मुश्किल है घटनास्थल पर क्या हुआ ये तो वहां जो तैनात थे उन अधिकारियों को ही पता होगा लेकिन इस घटना में किसी को गंभीर रूप से चोटें नहीं आई. Really, it's difficult to say for me. Without really understanding what uh, the uh, officials went through at the grassroots level at that point in time, and what led to the decision at that point in time, but I think what's important is that uh, nobody was, uh, you know, very really seriously hurt. Uh, what's important is that uh, you know these things happened, and uh, you know we will we have taken a report and everything from everybody, uh, and the more importantly the issues. That we're trying to address, we have tried to explain to everybody about the issues that were there. So we're trying to find out and ways and means in which we can explain to everybody. We have also mentioned that uh, we may be able to give some relief in terms of the age uh, condonation uh, at certain point in time. All these mentions have been done. Have been points have been mentioned by the education minister himself.